Hey, welcome back to my channel. It's Lolo. Today I'm going to be showing you my favorite go-to curly hairstyles. These are super quick. I think they're perfect for beginners. If you're new to styling curly hair, this is perfect for you. They take like five minutes or less. I usually do this when I'm running late for class, whatever. Actually, these are like my daily hairstyles, so I just wanted to show you guys. But also, I'm trying out some new curly hair products for you guys today. I am trying out this company called Jessie Curl. They sent me a collection of their hair, and what their little note says that Jessie Curl is all about accepting ourselves and loving our curls and what we share is a desire to have naturally beautiful curls and quality products to use on them so I asked for the um, rich and radiant collection the, this collection is best suited for thicker drier curly hair that needs moisture um, but they have other collections as well and so they sent me a whole bag of goodies thank you so much Jesse curl and yeah so I'm trying out all these products as I style my hair today and I'll let you know what I think at the end of the video also I'm doing a giveaway to one of my subscribers so stay tuned for the end of the video to see how you can enter for a chance to win these cute little mini Jesse curl products all right first I'm just gonna dampen my whole head this is just water inside my spray bottle and then I'm gonna use rock and ringlets from Jesse curl and it smells so good I'm just going to take a little bit of that and start smoothing down the front of my head and I'm doing the front first because that's the part that gets the most frizzy. So for this first style I'm going to be doing half up half down and so I'm just sectioning off my hair. Be careful not to rip your hair out. Now I'm just using a hair tie to put that part up. And then I just kind of fluff that hair out and then I also tug at my roots so that there's still some volume in the top of my head. And then I'm just going to take my spray bottle again and dampen the front part of my hair once more and then still in taking my rock and ringlets and use a little bit more of that to really smooth down the frizzy parts on top of my head. And then yes girl, I'm using a toothbrush, a clean one, don't worry. <laughs> and I'm going to smooth down my edges a little bit and I'm just wetting that with a water bottle because I'm not near my sink right now. I'm over you baby, so done. So now for this hairstyle, I'm basically using the same method I would do for half up, half down, but instead I'm doing half up, bun, half down. So I'm just going to not pull the hair all the way through and leave it in that bun, and then I'm just fluffing it out. And then I'm going to secure my bun down using some bobby pins, and yeah, that's it. Ones, but I like to use scrunchies for my bun and for my ponytails because they're like these are bigger and like thicker and more sturdy than like the regular hair ties so I feel like this really holds up my curls and my hair a lot better especially since my hair is like kind of wavy and looser curls in some parts I feel like this really makes it look full and holds the hairstyle into place a little bit better so let me show you what I mean now I'm taking the Awe and Spiraling Spray and just spraying this all over my hair to refresh my curls. And then I'm going to take a little bit of the Confident Coil Styling Solution and also work this all over my hair so that my curls are nice and shiny. Now I'm just going to flip my hair upside down and start gathering all of that hair on top of my head. And I'm going to use that scrunchie and put it in a ponytail. Guess what, guess what, 
Once it's in the ponytail, I'm just going to tug at the roots again, giving some volume on the top of my head, and then I am going to just play with my hair and like kind of manipulate it till I get my ponytail how I want it to look. And you can't forget to smooth those edges down, girl. <laughs> Taking rock and ringlets once again, I am just going to make sure my hair is all smoothed down. And then I'm also going to pull out some curls to frame my face. And then I'm just using some water and a little bit of the off spiraling spray. And I'm going to twirl those pieces around my finger to help them curl back up. So if I had a black hair tie, you wouldn't be able, like this wouldn't be as noticeable, but I just feel like it really helps the ponytail stay up and all this hair to like fountain out versus if I use a smaller hair tie, it kind of just goes straight back. It's not as full. And so yeah, I really like my ponytails to be like really big and like 90s feel, so yes. All right, moving on to the next hairstyle. This is my messy bun. So using my scrunchie, once again, I'm doing a similar method to how I do my ponytail. I'm just gathering all that hair on top of my head, but instead of pulling all the way through, I pull it mostly through, but I leave those inches out on my ends because I kind of like them to be out of the bun and give that messy feel. So I'm always just going to tug out my roots because I just, I don't like my hair to be flat to my scalp. And then I'm um, pulling those ends like from the back towards like the sides and I'm just going to mess with it and kind of fluff it out until it's like messy and cute how I like it. Alright, this is the top knot. So I'm going back to my skinny hair tie. And I'm gathering all that hair on top of my head. And then I'm just going to hold the ponytail with one hand and then twist the hair with the other. And then wrap it around and secure it with that elas elastic band. And then I'm just spraying my all spiraling spray and then smoothing down the hair with my hands. Alright, now I'm using my confident coils to take care of any frizz that's starting to happen from styling my hair. And then I'm also going to take the all spiraling and spray it where I'm about to part my hair so that's a little bit easier, it's not as tangled. And then I'm going to take that water and really dampen the front of my hair that we're about to style. So then I'm going to take the rocket ringlets and, oops, don't drop it. And then I'm going to take a little bit of that and really work that into the front of my hair. So, so now I don't really know what this is called, but it's kind of like how people French braid where it like sticks to your head. <laughs> but instead I'm doing a twist because it's easier and quicker to do in the morning. So I'm just twisting the hair around the crown of my head and picking up hair as I go. And then I just keep going down and down until... I'm above my ear a little bit and then I just finish off the twist and then pin it with some bobby pins right behind my ear. So again on the other side I just start twisting and like I keep picking up hair into the twist as I go down the crown of my head and then I just stop right above my ear and then I kind of just finish off the twist and then I use bobby pins and pin So now I'm just showing you another way that I like to wear this hairstyle and so instead of leaving it down I will gather it into a low pony. All right, for this next hairstyle, I really need my hair to be smooth and sleek, so I'm really wetting the front of my hair with that water bottle. And then I am taking the, what is this, confident coils, 
and really working that into the front of my hair as well, getting my hair really wet with product and stuff. And then I'm going to part my hair and I like to part it right down the middle for this hairstyle, but you could also part it to the side or wherever you want really. And then I'm going to take a, um, after really getting my hair wet, I'm going to take a smoothing brush or whatever you want to call it, a boar bristle brush, a boar bristle brush, I don't know why I can't say it. And then I'm going to use that brush and smooth down all the hair on top of my head, getting it really sleek, and then I'm just putting it into a low pony. And now I'm just going to show you another way like to wear this hairstyle instead of leaving it into a ponytail I will twist it up into a low bun and I really like this hairstyle for a protective hairstyle like for example if I have deep conditioner in my hair I will wear my hair like this out so that I can leave the deep conditioner in my hair for a longer amount of time. Okay guys, that's the end of the video, and so now for the review, like I said, well, Jessie Curl sent me these products, and a little bit about Jessie Curl, they are, um, all their products are made with natural ingredients that are great for the look and health of not just curly hair, but other types of hair as well. So I already showed you the styling products they sent me, the Rockin' Ringlets, the Awe Spiraling Spray, the Confident Coil, and they also sent me um, a deep conditioning treatment, um, a hair cleansing cream, and then another conditioner, and this is the Touche Extra Moisturizing Conditioner. So my review on these products, they smell awesome. They come in different scents, and I got the Island Fantasy scent. They smell absolutely amazing, and my hair still feels super soft and touchable. I don't like it when my hair gets crunchy. I don't like products like really like gels or anything like that because I feel like it dries my, out my hair makes it too crunchy so my hair still feels super soft and really moisturized so that's awesome and now for the giveaway so they sent me a mini set of all the products I just showed you it's perfect like travel size awesome it comes with their little card that tells you all about it and all you have to do to win this awesome giveaway is subscribe to my channel and then leave me a comment telling me your favorite curly hairstyle from this video and then also follow me on Instagram at Lolo Saunders and I'm going to post about this giveaway so once you've done all that just comment done on that Instagram post to let me know and then I will be announcing the winner on my Instagram page. I also have a coupon code for you guys. The coupon code is HOPE. And they are doing an awesome Black Friday sale. It starts on uh, November 24th through the 28th. And it's worth 30% off all 8 ounce items. So that's pretty awesome. So yeah, thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. The Island Fantasy scent. It smells so good. I absolutely love it. And wait, I just smelled a bottle. It's Kappa stuff. <laughs>